Hello, this is Lance Johnson again. Station Casinos set layoffs. Profits will reopen in phases. CEO writes to staff. Station Casinos announced Friday that the company is laying off a significant number of both property and corporate employees. <sighs> Excuse me, effective May 16th. We are trying to retain our entire team, but in the face of the continued uncertainty, we can no longer do so, CEO and Chairman Frank Fratita III said, and let us sit to staff Friday. The news comes come as the Governor Sislak announced the the state mandatory closure of casinos will be extended to at least May 15th or when phase one of the state reopening <clears throat> is set to begin. <clears throat> Sislak and the casinos will not be open in start of phase one. For Tita, a place to reopen station casino province in phases with Red Rock, Green Valley, Ranch Resort, Santa Fe, Boulder Station, Palace Station, Sunset Station, and a company uh Wildfire division will be first to open the doors. Project Henson, Fiesta Ranch, the station will be the company is able to assess business performance in a post C19 world. When we are permitted to open, we don't know what business will look like. Fertita said, other than knowing that the business levels will be lower as a result of the unprecedented crisis, the county will not for a front face approach. Social distancing restrictions at casinos making meaningful staffing level reductions at the province that will open first and its corporate office, along with significant reductions at province that are not open in the initial phase. The letter did not say exactly how long, how many workers will be let go. The casino, oh, excuse me, the casino operator has roughly 14,000 employees as of January 31st, according to the latest annual filings with the Securities and Exchange Commission. Full-time staff who are laid off will be paid through May 16th. The company is still a medical and dental division benefits through September 30th, including coverage for full premium costs at May 16th. Those whose employment status is unaffected by layoffs will continue to receive regular pay and benefits through May 31st. Previous stations of the said it will offer regular and health benefits to all Alex at seven full time team members through May 15th. It, it, it moved uh, nearly seven part time employees to full staff so they could receive full benefits. For a teacher advised those affected by the layoff, single employment insurance benefits and federal benefits that Station Tino will assist staff with access. This has been the most challenging and painful situation in our company's history. Fertitta said in a letter, we are hoping that Drew that Las Vegas will rebound swiftly and allow us to rehire men of our value team members. So we, us, excuse me, we emerge on the other side of the crisis. So, so there you have it. Uh, Station Casinos is laying off people because of, of the C-19 epidemic, but uh, let let me uh, hear your thoughts in the comments. Listening, see something, say something. Wash wash your hands. Cover your mouth when sneezing and coughing. Don't be a hoarder. Think about others. You feel sick, stay at home. Like that's right. Thanks for listening. Have a good day. Thank you.